Well, Poland's uh, double national champion is uh, next to find in the red 27-year-old from Warsaw. This is uh, Lukas Mazezik. And Lukas is uh, up against the Russian fourth-ranked boxer in this weight division. This is David Arapetian, 28 years of age, 158 centimeters in height. Born in Baku, believe it or not, but now boxing out of Russia. Twice the Russian national champion and the silver medalist at the last IEB World Championships in Milan in 2009. He was beaten by Zadamba, the Mongolian boxer, in the final. Also third in the 2007 Worlds, the Russian boxer. Clearly. Now, for the Polish boxer, you see the graphic there, WSC. His first season in the World Series of Boxing for the Polish boxer. This is the new... World Series that has been set up by the International Boxing Association. A huge success where cities create teams that go up against each other in a conference. Confirmation of the five judges for this bout. Very interesting to see how the Polish boxer in the red with a lot of experience on the WSB where perhaps the most obvious difference is that there are no, no headgear worn, but WSB athletes can still qualify for the Olympic Games. Arapetian is an established and seasoned amateur. With medals, as we said earlier, from both the 2007 and the 2009 World Championships, another very interesting bout. Both boxers looked impressive in their preliminary matches. Oh, Arapetian with a couple of big hits, nice and early. Zizek in red for Poland. Looking confident here. Not phased by the Russian at all. But again, good skills from Arapetian. Mixing up the shots. the Russian well Arapetian in the blue corner with Olympic experience qualified for Beijing in 2008 got taken out of the competition in the preliminary rounds and would love a second shot at Olympic glory. He's been given a tough test in this round of 16. Clearly the taller and bigger build of the two boxers. The pole in the red. And good shots from uh, Arapetian, 28-year-old Russian now, settling out nicely in this first round. A 
Pretty good uppercut there. Through the defense. Tries the same shot again. Well, a confidence building round for the Russian. Comfortably ahead of the Polish boxer in the red corner. 8 to 2 for David Arapetian. Very, very quick, the Russian boxer in blue. There's the scores from the pole. Taking advantage of his height whenever possible. But that's a good start for the fourth-ranked boxer in this light fly division. Confirmation. Eight to two, six-point advantage going into the second round. Going the way the form book expected. And Arapetian starts the second in the same way as he did the first. Quick. Fast combinations. He's also very quick at covering up. Working defensively, just watch the shoulder the referee says to the Polish boxer in the red. But uh, he's got the wind between his teeth now, hasn't he? He really has the bit between his teeth, the wind between his sails. That's what I'm trying to say. Confidence is now riding high for the Russian boxer in blue. Halfway through the second round. Scoring here in the commentary box still has the Russian clear. Just failing to connect with that hook. There's so much leverage from the body. But again, very, very quick with the hands. Trying to get through the defense of Lukas. Lukas Mazeziak of that Poland. attack from the Russian showing all of the skills I'm not sure the red boxer out of Poland has got the answers to this Keeps, keeps that momentum going and covers up very well. Six points clear from the first round and I've got him clear in the second round as well. Better finish from the Polish boxer. There's the bell for the end of round two. And another decisive win for David Arapetian. Now 15 points to five, 10 points clear of uh, Lukas Mazeziak from uh, Poland. In control of this bout now, the fourth ranked boxer in the light fly division.
Kalimi Alentezev and Eduardo Tezag Kayev, the coaches for the uh, Russian boxer. Clear instruction there, keep it moving, keep out of trouble. 15-5, 10 point advantage going into the third and final round for the Russian boxer out of the blue corner. That's uh, David Arapatian. And again, Arapatian, of course, who's uh, looking to complete the set of world championship medals. 2007 in Chicago took the bronze. 2009, he's got a silver. And with this kind of confidence and skill level, it could well be a gold here. Wouldn't surprise me if we saw Arapatian meet Zushiming in the final of this uh, light fly division. And what's impressed many here, and I'm sure has helped his confidence, is that the Polish boxer a lot taller, a longer reach, just an adjustment to the head guard there. Clock, as you can see in the left of your screen, stops. And away we go again. Two minutes left in the third and final round. And if he just stays calm and keeps rolling out the tactic that he's demonstrated and the game plan that he's laid down in the first two rounds, Arapatian goes through to the quarterfinals. Perhaps most importantly, the prize for today is Olympic qualification. Well, both boxers showing great stamina and strength here. Both still putting together powerful combinations. There's a lovely shot from Arapatian. The right hook. Well, I'm sure you'll agree that uh, Lucas Maseziak has uh, fought bravely. 27 year old. Seventh in the Olympics, seventh in the 2009 World Championships. He's made a better boxer here today. And that 10 point lead remains intact for me, for David Arapatian. Just 20 seconds, 15 seconds now. And again, the Russian demonstrating that he's got the combinations, he's still got the speed at the end of the three three-minute rounds. And uh, that's something that will keep him in good stead as he tries to progress through the quarterfinals into the semis and to the final. Good work from both boxers there. But the Russian, David Arapatian, dominating. Looked a little uneasy at the opening stages of the first round but took control going into the second. And the Polish boxer knows that sadly, his world championship is over. And this man on your screens at 28 years of age, I certainly believe is right on track to try and add that gold to his collection of silver and bronze world championship medals that he has collected in his career to date. <laughs> Confirmation 24 to 7, a comfortable victory for Arapatian. Russian goes through the quarterfinals, also books his ticket to the London 2012 Olympic Games.